everybody, welcome back to another project update video. First, you're probably wondering what I got going on here. This is a project I'm working on over on my other YouTube channel. Uh, it's just kind of a personal project of mine. I'm converting a guitar from a right-handed guitar into a left-handed guitar, uh, replacing a bunch of parts and rewiring it and doing all kinds of cool stuff. It's going to be a really cool project. If you'd like to follow along with that build, I'm not going to be posting it here on this channel. It's going to be on my other channel, and I'll put a link below in the description. So if you've seen my speaker shelf build, remember when I built it, I routed the groove in the back that the wire passes up through, but I didn't account for the mounting hole running right through that groove. When I went to mount it on the wall, I just didn't have quite enough room for that wire to have enough clearance between the mounting screw and the edge of the groove. So all I did to fix that was I took a Forstner bit and drilled a little recess around that mounting hole on the back side and that gave it just enough room for the wire to move out of the way so the screw could go into the wall. Other than that, I didn't have any problems with that build. It went along pretty well. The last project I did was this quick little cordless drill shelf back here. The only thing I've done to that was I took a little bit of white paint and just painted around the edge so it wasn't so much bare wood showing. One other thing I need to do with that is it's a little bit too low. I don't quite have enough room down here. Uh, I found myself, I always have stuff on the top of this little workspace here, and I need to raise that up a little bit. I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. And while I've got the shelf down, I'm gonna drill a hole in the side so that I can pass the cable for the charger through. better. A little bit more space down there, keeps things out of my way. But just a quick project update, a couple things I'm working on here in the shop. Again, if you want to follow along on that guitar build, please head over to my other YouTube channel and subscribe to that one as well and you won't miss any of it. It's going to be really cool. I'm really excited about that one. Thanks for watching. 